Hi folks, Lou here, and I'm going to address a specific question, which I saw somewhere or other, I don't remember where, and that was, as a game designer, when you need a solution to a design problem, do you do a mechanic search to find a mechanic that will solve that problem? I think probably a lot of people do this. I do not, and I'll try to say why. Um, First of all, I can say Reiner Knizia, in I have read, does not want to know a lot about a lot of other games because he wants to make his own solutions. So I very much doubt that he does a mechanic search. I'm not averse to using a mechanic I hear of. I, there's no problem because it's very unlikely that you are going to make up your own mechanic that's actually original that nobody's ever done. And if the mechanic works what counts is how good the game is. And there are a limited number of uh, mechanics that I've found that I think, oh, I could use that, but somehow I don't seem to have done so. For example, uh, I learned from a game called Feudal the idea that you'd had a, a limited number of negotiation opportunities. You had tokens, and you'd use a token in order to have a negotiation opportunity. And that if you had three tokens, you could negotiate three times during the game, and that was it. Clever, and I may use it someday. And I asked myself, why didn't I think of that? And that, of course, is my reaction to these ideas that I think are pretty good. Another one is the advantage-disadvantage that I learned of from Dungeons & Dragons 5th edition, although I suspect it already existed. And that's where you roll two dice instead of one to determine something, usually d20s, and Depending on the situation, if you have advantage, you take the best of those two roles. If you have disadvantage, you take the worst of those two roles, and that's what counts. Also coming from 5th edition, as far as I know, is the tuning of magic items, which limits the usage of magic items considerably. You've got to tune the magic item to yourself before you can use it, and you can only tune like three. Uh, so I haven't used any of those mechanics, but I admire them, and all three I said, why didn't I think of that? Now, there's nothing wrong with a mechanic search. There's even a book that details bunches of modern board game mechanics. One of the authors is Jeff Engelstein, and I don't recall the, the name of the other one. I have not read the book um, because I'm not much interested in mechanic searches, and especially not in modern um, board game mechanics, because modern board games tend to be non-conflict games, and I much prefer conflict games. I'm kind of with uh, Greg Kostikian, who said, uh, a game without struggle is a game that's dead. So, as a designer, it's up to you. You can make up your own, you can borrow, um, whichever works for you. Thanks for listening.